Um, I'm sorry. I, uh... I know, I know. It's been one of those days, right? Yeah. Don't you come in. Um... I, uh... I just, uh... I found out about this, this, this meeting about the Miranda Center. That was, um... That was one of Zach's projects. Mm. But they left me out. So I charged over there to prove that I could still be in charge. And instead, you went to pieces. You must think I'm crazy to care so much. I should probably just stay home and take care of myself. But the truth is that when I work on the Miranda project, it makes me feel closer to Zach. Yeah, I know. And I need that. I need it otherwise. I'm lost. But you, you gotta know, it's not always gonna be like this. How do you know that? Because I've counseled a lot of parishioners who have suffered a tragic loss. But what do you do when you've lost a part of yourself? A part that you can never get back? It's still there, Kendall. That never goes away. I feel so scattered, you know? I feel like I'm just searching everywhere and I'm trying to, I'm trying to feel connected again. You're doing great. I've seen you with your boys being a mom to them. And so what if you're, you're still a bit of a mess? Who isn't, right? You're still getting up every morning, you're putting on your shoes, and you're taking another step every day. That's just the thing, like when I start to move forward, I, I fall back again. I start questioning everything, like, why did Zach have to die, and why did it happen? You're never going to know the answer to those questions. So this, this Miranda Center expansion, it meant a lot to Zach? Yeah. Then try again. And what if I fall apart again? Then let me know. I'm pretty good at putting pieces back together. I don't know how to help my sister. It's out of my area of expertise. Whew. She isn't always... She had a heart transplant a couple years ago. Yeah, transplant. She was gonna make it. She's had quite a life. Yeah. She wasn't what I thought she would be like from Zach's description. Uh, yeah, she's a complicated person. That's why we love her so much. So you wanna get back to the donation list? We can get back to it. Kendall. Listen, I don't think Kendall really she, knows. She will she be seen. fine. She's uh, had her heart ripped out in a different way this time. She's the strongest person I know. I don't know why people put themselves in this. Through what? Falling in love. You know, letting in someone so deep that it wrecks their life, it leaves them hopeless. What? If I, if I have to explain it to you, you are too hopeless for words. Well, thank you very much for that assist. You know, kids can be a tough audience. Oh, you were doing great, you know, just couldn't resist. Made me think of that little boy from Equatoria. Hmm, so. yeah. I'm sorry, I, uh, I should have just... Let you do your thing. No, no, yeah. no, no, no. Are you yeah. kidding me? I was, I couldn't believe you remembered funny faces. That was like a... Some things you never forget. Hey, Kara. Hey. Hi. Babe. Did I miss anything exciting? No, no, nothing at all. I'll send Madison flowers. Everything will be fine. Will it? Yes. She said she wants to be left alone. Sounds good to me. 
You're the one who said we should stay away from each other. I ran into Madison to confusion yesterday. She got a call from the hospital. About what? I don't know. I don't know. I just figured that it had to do with her shoulder, you know, the gunshot that she's not taken care of because she doesn't have the money. So what I did is I made an appointment with a specialist. Ryan. Well, she canceled it. She had it canceled. I shouldn't want to accept help. From you. That's her choice. Something more's going on here, Greenlee. I, I can tell. I mean, she quit her job, and now, now she's talking about moving away? About that. I just feel bad. I want to help. You know, I want to do something. But I know I can't keep pushing like that. It just Can makes I everything just... worse. It's just, and it's the holidays, and everything's so crazy right now. Kendall is still suffering, and Erica is... is... I don't know, she's facing charges, and I just, I just know that with all this craziness, I, I just, I need to keep focused on what's important. I have to focus on, on us. You do? Yeah. We can't get lost in all of this craziness. We just gotta focus on, on you and me. We just gotta take one day, maybe, to spend time together and just turn off all the phones and shut out the world. What do you say about that? Yes. Hey. Sorry. About before. Me too. Um, I just came over to see if you wanted help getting ready for Christmas. Um, no, that's, that's okay. I, I don't really think now is such a good time. Okay. Uh, let me, let me just get the stockings. The boys have been wanting to hang them up. Okay. Miranda keeps checking hers every day. Closet off the guest room. Oh, I didn't put it there. Zach did. I gotta tell you, I'm a little surprised. I thought maybe you would fight me on this. Why would I fight spending alone time with you? Well, I don't know. Just like ever since I ran into you in Madison. Something's kind of seemed up with you. I just figured maybe it had something to do with me. Everything's fine. Good. Because I really want to do this. I want to I just take a day. You know, I do. But? But it's, it's tough. It's the holidays and things are so crazy right now. It feels a little... feels a little selfish to check out. We're allowed to be selfish for one day. Yeah? Yeah. Okay. So then maybe we could start with a little breakfast in bed. And then maybe like a little lunch in mm -hmm. bed, and mm -hmm. then some dinner in bed, mm -hmm. and a little bit more bed time <laughs> after that. How's it sound so far? Mm -hmm. I have to tell you something. If we do this, I might stay here forever. Forget there's anyone else except us. It's been hard. What have you guys been doing? Uh, and paperwork. And paperwork, both things. Uh, you know what? Your timing is impeccable. Did you know that? I, no, why? Oh, it is because Kara was called in by Angie to cover a ship, but there's not much going on. I thought maybe I'll pull a little rank and I'll just uh, punch out a little early so I can spend some quality time with my wife. Are you okay with that? Oh, absolutely, yeah. Absolutely awesome, fantastic. Okay, great. Uh, if anything does happen, have someone call me. Have fun. Hey, save anybody fun today? <laughs> Where were you just now? thinking about what I'm going to do to pass the time. Jake around? Oh, keep slept. With Amanda. So how's it going? Working with him? Oh, it's like he's not even here. I hardly ever see him. 
for Ian. For Spike. Must have uh, hidden them a while ago. To my wife. Do you want to open it? Here. Hey, Mom's here. Uncle Jack. We love you so much. And we are going to get through this together. I am going to make us some tea.